Rhodes. Good morning, all you wonderful money masters out there. Welcome, I'm Steve Rhodes, host of the Trader's Edge, and thank you so, so much for joining me. For all of you folks out in uh, Washington and Spokane, it's time to get up. It's, it's your 608 alarm, if you will. Time to stretch, and for everybody else that's up already on the East Coast or overseas, you know, it's, it's a good thing maybe just to sit up tall just for a minute and take in a couple of deep breaths, change your state, if you will, and, and, and I first want to start off by saying thank you to so many of the wonder, all of the wonderful tigers, tigresses that came out and uh, visited, attended the workshop that Tom and I put together on this past Saturday. We held down here at the uh, Grand Height in Tampa. It was an absolute uh, outstanding function. It was uh, every part of every piece of every vision that I absolutely had. It was so wonderful to meet folks. We had people come in from the state of Washington, from Minnesota, from New Jersey, as well as all of the local base of folks. And it was really a, a wonderful uh, time, a wonderful event. And, you know, there were folks there. We talk about, talk about vision right now. You can watch us on Tiger TV. You can go to the uh, front page of TFNN.com. And on the third tab, you'll see Tiger TV. You can watch this show live. You see what's on my screen. And right now what I've got on my screen, at least for everybody that, uh, that's familiar with me or certainly everybody that was attending the uh, workshop over the weekend, they know this is my favorite spot. They know this is one of my ways to be able to put myself in what we'll call a peak state. And, uh, and it's so important to understand that. Now, my voice might sound a little bit uh, harsh because uh, going for that uh, three, three-plus hours or what have you, um, you know, I literally, literally wiped out my uh, sound cord just a little bit, but uh, didn't wipe out my energy, you know, folks, and I absolutely love being here with you. This is truly, you know, my favorite time of the day, and what was the coolest thing about, uh, about Saturday, received a number of emails, and thank you so much for taking time to uh, write, and what I know is we spent a lot of time on vision, uh, the importance of it, uh, there was a lot that uh, each of us learned uh, at the event, uh, and I, I believe that folks left with a better sense of the importance of being able to paint a picture, being able to paint a vision. We did a very cool uh, gratitude exercise. Uh, you know, maybe some point in time we'll be able to do that over the uh, over the airwaves as well. And but what's most important is everybody left there with the ability to be an even better role model. You know, whether it's for for their children, for their grandchildren, for their spouses, for their friends, uh, for their fellow tiger, you know, and that's really what it's all about. It's really all about being able to find another gear and really be able to lead, whether it's leading yourself, you know, so folks absolutely left there with the ability to uh, lead themselves. You know, we talked about vision, uh, you know, Will in Fort Myers, he's already got his uh, new uh, car picked out, if you will, and I asked him to go actually find one and test drive it because, uh, you know, it was a, uh, it was, it's a unique, it was a Shelby that he's after, and, uh, and he also, he's also got a new condo, and so, you know, it's just great to really be able to touch people's lives, because the coolest thing was, you know, we had 100 plus people that touched my life just simply by being there and the energy that I got from it. So I look forward to being able to do that event, uh, hopefully in a city uh, near you, or maybe it'll be close enough for you to travel to it, and, uh, you know, with regard to the uh, markets, you know, we can take a look at the uh, markets uh, right now. You've got the uh, Dow futures look like they're down about uh, 62 points. The Nasdaq's down about 17. The uh, ES Mini looks like it's down maybe about six or so. And we'll take a look at the markets because I know everybody wants to know, you know, what's going on, especially after a weekend, especially after, uh, especially after such a big downdraft, if you will, or what seemed like it coming into a Friday. We had the market up and down all around as uh, Tom likes to say, as is the reality. Right now what's up on my screen here is the uh, DAX chart. And, and so on the DAX, we feature the DAX because it's been one of those charts that has been leading us down. We'll take a look at overseas. You know, if we take a look at the Hang Seng, we've been talking about the uh, trouble that the Hang Seng has, down 770 points uh, this morning when, when it closed. You had the... Uh, Nikkei down looks like maybe about 150 points, and we'll we'll take a look at that. You know, what does it mean for something to be up or down? What is it going into? How does it relate to any Fibonacci uh, uh, work? You know, we didn't do any of that on uh, Saturday. We did play a money game. We had a blast, uh, certainly playing a money game and giving out some uh, prizes, and that was a lot of fun. Now, if we take a look at the DAX chart here, you can see right now it's trading at 53.39. So it uh, and, and you know it had to play catch up 
with whatever went on in our markets on Friday. Was it the Kodak thing? You know, that's pretty amazing. You know, here you've got, uh, you know, a company that's been around for 100 plus years, you know, big behemoth, if you will. And, uh, you know, if we go take a look at what their stock is selling for, it's, you know, in essence, they are bankrupt, if you will. And so it'll be interesting to see what really happens there. But certainly that was a spook of the market. You know, you still have all the issues going on in Greece. And, and the reality, folks, is, look, we're, we're, in, we're in a liquidity. Uh, there's a liquidity event that's going to be ongoing inside our markets for, for a while. Not for a week, not for a month, uh, not for two months, for a while here. And, uh, and it's going to be important to be able to protect yourselves. That's why we use stops. It's why we take a look at probability management when we're trading. It's why we understand the power of one. That's, that's not just the power of you, but it's the power of 1% on your, of risking uh, your capital to understand how that can turn out to be, turn into massive rewards for you. But we take a look at the DAX here. It opened up, uh, I would have preferred to see it open up a little bit lower. I would have preferred to see it open up right at that point six one eight, that uh, 52, 52 area, because it would have been exhausted, uh, just like I was Saturday uh, afternoon or late evening or early evening uh, after uh, after the buildup for so many weeks putting together the presentation that uh, that Tom and I gave on uh, Saturday. And uh, but it did open up, you know, certainly much lower. It's starting to move up a little bit. If we go take a look at what's going on with the uh, other. Uh, we take a look at around the world. If we take a look at the Shanghai, and this is why it's important to to understand, you know, what's going on here in the Shanghai. Simply, one of the things here, you'll see these little round circles, and these round circles are just simply going from the low that the Shanghai made on June twentieth uh, to the next low that it made, uh, and that was came in on August 9th. That was a uh, looks like about a thirty-five day uh, time period, thirty-five, thirty-six day time period. The next cycle actually came in on September 29th and you can see September 29th well okay you know today is when it's made it's a uh, next low uh, that happens to you know it happens to be a version of a three drive to a bottom pattern that we see on the uh, Shanghai daily and if we pull up and that's just simply coming right back into the lows here from the uh, July August time frame of 2010 I think if I have the weekly chart let me just switch over here and see if the weekly Pops up now in the weekly chart. You know what this clearly shows is the Shanghai has got still has much more work to the downside to do. Now the way that the market works, folks, is it breathes. It goes in and out just like you and I do. And uh, right now the work that it's really trying to complete is the work where it's going against the July lows, the July 2010 lows, and the Shanghai that would be 23.56. Again, that got down to 23.59. So that is uh, pretty close uh, for 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 my work. And we may see with that three drive-ish pattern, if you will, on the daily chart. Uh, that is setting up a uh, possibility of the Shanghai uh, to bounce from here. To me, uh, the, uh, the, the better play on the Shanghai from a longer term weekly perspective is when the Shanghai makes its way all the way down to 2078. That sets up a just a, you know, I use, we use the word maybe perfect, just an ideal Gartley, if you will, an outstanding Gartley pattern because you've got all these great uh, sacred geometry numbers. You have a 786 retracement off of the lows from October of 08. You've got a 786 retracement off of the highs from August of 09. You've got a 1.272 expansion from the July 10 time frame all the way up to the November 19th where it made some highs. And just an ideal, you know, Gartley pattern. So hopefully you're watching this on Tiger TV so you can see this because these are great trading patterns that you want to learn how to trade with because they really put some probability uh, on your side. If we go take a look at what else is going on around the world, let's take a look, a, a quick peek here in the uh, UK and the uh, FTSE. And if we take a look at the FTSE, uh, you can see the FTSE right now trading at 5,033. And what the FTSE has done here is if we just go take a look at the retracement from the lows of uh, September 23rd all the way up to the high that it made on September 28th, folks, it's uh, made a 0.786 retracement and now it's starting to move up from there. Uh, so, uh, so its work seems to be done as well. If we take a look at the uh, Nikkei here, uh, the Nikkei right now it's trading at, where's the Nikkei? Right here. Trading at uh, 85.45 and you can see that the Nikkei pushed well off of its lows this morning. Uh, you know, it got down to a low of uh, 84.55 and uh, finished 100 points up at 85. 45, 90 points up, if you will. So that is uh, suggesting that possibly some work is done to the uh, uh, downside. Now, so how do you, you know, that's what's going on in the world. So then how do we go ahead and, and take a look at, you know, how are things happening? You know, what, what does that mean in the U.S.? So, you know, we talk about the dollar index. Now, the dollar index is that basket of currencies, the largest currency being the euro. So what you really want to do next is you'd like to take a look at the uh, euro, 
to see how the euro is trading. And so if we go over to the uh, currency marketplace, we take a look at the euro. Uh, what I have up here on the screen is the uh, euro chart. And you can see right now it's trading at 133.081 in essence. 133.031 would be the 0.786 retracement. So as long as the euro holds that area, um, what it really does, I don't have the, the pattern. I'll go ahead and draw the pattern on the screen for you. It's really set up a, 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 a Gartley pattern, a Gartley buy pattern. So we've got that. You can see how when this draws out here, you can see the nice little blue wings that it's got, the blue just to match my shirt, if you will. And that sets up a, a Gartley buy pattern. So as long as it holds this area here, then the euro should bounce. Now, if it fails from here, what this would be setting up likely is a, this, this would be a butterfly pattern. When a Gartley pattern fails, folks, they will turn into a butterfly pattern. Now, when I say that, and what I really mean by that, is a 0.618 Gartley, when it fails, it will go to the 0.786 area. When the 0.786 area fails, that's when you set up the likelihood of a butterfly pattern. It will at least do a move to move, which is something that Tom has taught us all. In fact, if you don't have the art of timing the trade about the best $18 investment that I could ever think of making uh, in myself. You absolutely should do that because it'll teach you about uh, these Gartley patterns. It'll teach you about a move of a move. In that case here, if this area fails, what this is saying is saying that the euro would get all the way down to 128.57. If we do that, we'll see substantial pressure uh, in our marketplace. So the first place when you want to take a look at the dollar index is you really want to understand that currency pair of the uh, euro US dollar. And now if we go over to the uh, dollar index here, and uh, we're just about to come into our first break. If we take a look at the dollar index. Now, what you can see in the dollar index, it too has made a Gartley. In this case here, it's made a Gartley sell. On Friday, I think we talked about the Gartley, the 618 Gartley that it made in the 7828 area, moved all the way up to 7970. Well, 7976 would have been the uh, 0.786 retracement. The dollar index got up to, you gotta love it, 7973, folks. Anyways, 877 Six six four eight. It is so good to be here with you. We'll be right back. Studies show that 10,000 hours is what it takes to achieve outstanding results, unless you use the power of leverage. The power of leverage, folks, is key to attaining outstanding success in your trading and investing. I'm Steve Rhodes, co-host of The Money Masters with Tom O'Brien, seen daily at TFNN.com, and author of Mastering Probability, a daily trading and investment newsletter. Let me take your trading to a new level, a whole new level. Let me teach you the secrets that the real money masters use each and every Every day to produce consistent financial results. On top of that, I'll transform your life in ways you never thought imaginable. You'll overcome hurdles like an Olympian. Here's the beauty. I'm so certain that I'll transform your life. I'm giving you a 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Time, folks. Something you'll never get back. The time is now to take action. Go to the homepage of TFNN.com and order Mastering Probability. It'll change your life forever. TFNN is proud to bring you the cutting edge of newsletters. Ken Shreve's Ultimate Growth Stocks. Ken is a top-down investor who lets price and volume in the major stock indices tell him when to be in the market and when to be out. By using his unique blend of fundamental and technical analysis, Ken will protect your hard-earned capital while realizing breakout gains. Go to TFNN.com today. Click Investments Newsletters and get Ken Shreve's Ultimate Growth Stocks free for two weeks. For some extra cash to help pay off some of your bills, let Tiger Metal Exchange convert your unwanted jewelry to cash. We pay out 80% of the market price for gold. Our payouts are the highest in the industry, more than double our largest competitors. And we've created the safest, easiest, and most straightforward process for converting your jewelry to cash. Log on to TigerMetalExchange.com and get your free scale, your free eye loop, and get the cash you deserve now. We provide a free online calculator that converts your jewelry to cash at up-to-the-minute spot prices. We insure your items for up to $75,000 per shipment free of charge. We videotape the entire valuation process so that you can view it online. You can call us toll-free at 866-618-8888 or log on to TigerMetalExchange.com. Let Tiger Metal Exchange put more cash in your pocket without ever leaving the comfort of your home. Join the list of thousands of satisfied customers and go to TigerMetalExchange.com. It's the only click you need to make. 
Would you like to discover the next great tech stock? David White, TFNN's technology guru, has just launched his new newsletter, The Technology Insider. In his newsletter, David will be looking for those shining stars that may turn into the next Apple, Microsoft, or Cisco. David combines his technology background as a software programmer with his market skills as a successful professional trader to give you this unique newsletter. We're on the verge of the next great tech run. With the Technology Insider, you'll be in front of the run-up and not lagging behind. David is developing a long-term investment portfolio. Therefore, we're only offering the Technology Insider as an annual subscription with a remarkable price of only $395. That's right. For a little over $1 a day, you'll receive the fundamental technology wisdom and technical trading skills of the technology insider David White. What are you waiting for? Go to the front of TFNN.com, click on the link on the front page, sign up for your two-week free trial, and become a technology insider today. Here's what people are saying about Tiger TV. Let's go to John in Tampa. Hey, John, what's going on? Hi, Tom. How are you, sir? I'm doing great. You having a good day out there? A wonderful day. I love your Tiger TV. I watch it every day. I'm like a kid in a candy store. Oh, man, I appreciate you out there watching it. How long have you been watching the Tiger TV? I watch it almost a month now, and it's just it's wonderful. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Oh, yes, it's cool. You see the charts and everything. Thanks so much for the hard work. Tiger TV, a great news service from TFNN.com. This segment is brought to you by TFNN. Don't forget, you can test drive all the newsletters for free at TFNN.com. Mm, it's always better when we're together. Yeah, we'll look at them stars when we're together. Well, it's always better when we're together. Yeah, it's always better when we're together. It absolutely is, folks. Welcome back, 877-927-6648. And I tell you, it has been great for stargazing around here. We've had uh, just this beautiful break in the uh, weather. I mean, the uh, this morning on the way in, it was in the uh, middle 60s. I think this afternoon it's supposed to be in the 80s. And, uh, folks, uh, if you're up in the north and uh, you'd like to... Uh, Come and see the most outstanding weather. You know, come on down, visit us. You can visit us. You can meet us uh, at uh, Suite 618. And, you know, we talk about these retracement areas, and they're just sacred geometry numbers. So I don't want them to spook you. You don't have to be a math uh, person or a math nut. But they're just simply tools on your ruler, if you will, that we use to draw between our swing points. So we were talking about the dollar index uh, before we went to break, and the dollar index, we're taking a look at a high swing point of $81.64. That was uh, the mark uh, from January 10th, 2011. And if you use your retracement ruler and draw it all the way down to lows that we had in the May time frame, May 4th, uh, 72.86, if you will. Uh, and if you just simply took your ruler and you had a 0 0.382, that's our first retracement floor. 0.618 is our second and 0.786 is our third. And we had on Friday, I know on the show, we were taking a look at the 0.618. That was setting up a nice Gartley pattern. And when you uh, buy these Gartley patterns or sell these Gartley patterns, your stop should always really be on the other side of that next level up. If uh, And that's why you really want to understand uh, position sizing. Uh, we I've got a position sizing calculator that my subscribers uh, use. So it makes it easier for them to go ahead and enter a trade based on a recommendation either that I have or one that they're identifying on their own. And position sizing, folks, is really what it's all about. Position sizing, understanding position sizing will have more of an impact on your trading uh, success than anything else that I, can, uh, that I can imagine out there. It's more important than your entry point, more important than your exit point, and uh, because it forces you to understand your risk and it forces you to understand your risk per share, your risk per contract, uh, whatever it is that it is that you're trading. Now, in this case here, again, we took a look at the euro, which was the biggest basket. It makes sense that uh, the euro is making a Gartley buy, and the dollar index here is making a Gartley sell. So now, on the U.S. dollar index, if this 79.75-ish area doesn't hold, it'll go up to 81.64, but it will likely do more than that. It will set up the next uh, pattern, which would be a butterfly pattern. And if we go take a look at that, that would uh, end up taking the uh, dollar into the 8402 oh, area. That's this 1.272 expansion uh, that shows up on my screen. And do watch us on Tiger TV, folks. It absolutely is a great way to take a look at what's going on now. You've got three minutes before the uh, market's open. So let's go slide on over to the uh, futures and see what we have over here. On the futures, 
If we take a look at the ES Mini, that's the S&P uh, futures contract, folks. What you can see there is that the you've got a Gertley buy pattern. Now, there was a Gertley buy pattern that came in last night. Maybe it was around the 9.30, 10 o'clock uh, time frame. Uh, in fact, uh, Let's see here. Yeah, right, right around that time, 7:30 or so time frame, and uh, it was a 1.618. If you can see, I'll just blow this up a little bit bigger here, and you can see the expansion. That's the expansion of uh, of the swing point. This right here being the 21:30 time frame on the uh, September 28th, all the way up to the 11:30 uh, in the morning time frame on September 29th, and a 1.618 expansion of that. Brought it right into the 1121 area. Now you also had an A B equals C D pattern. The A point being the start at about 2:30 in the afternoon on the 27th, all the way down to that B. Brought you all the way up to C, and a one to one A B C came at 112170. We're trading at 1119 right now. You can see how it moved down just a little bit further than that uh, during the uh, you know early morning session, uh, if you will. And you really, if the market is going to bounce from here, it really needs to hold this low area. Uh, this low being really the low of the uh, 3.30 in the morning bar, the low there being 11, 11.25. But you do have these Gartley patterns, and, and as I say, if this area here doesn't hold, because this is, you know, the 0.786, not only will we go test the uh, bottom, the bottom, really, when we take a look at the ES Mini contract, is the September 23rd time frame. The low there was 11.02. Uh, that, it will go down, it will test that area. Uh, if that area doesn't hold, then what you'll see, in fact, let's go ahead and draw it in here, on the ES Mini contract before we go to break. If we take a look at where that failure would take us, that failure on the ES Mini would take us all the way down to 1078. So this area needs to hold. It's, it's set up with regard to the dollar index. It's set up with regard to the currencies. It's set up with regard to what else is going on around the world. And uh, uh, you know, right now, if we go take a look real quickly here at the other uh, ETFs, let's take a look at the uh, NASDAQ futures. If we can pull that up here real quick, the NASDAQ futures, I don't have the daily. Well, but you can see even on the 30-minute chart here, if we could simply go from the swing low all the way up to the high, uh, what we've done is we've simply done that 0.618 retracement at 21.1184. What did it actually hit? 21.1175. you got to love this stuff. you got to love these numbers. 877-927-6648. This is Tom O'Brien. If you want to get great trade setups in equity as well as the option market, come over to TFNN.com and test drive my daily newsletter, Market Insights, for two weeks absolutely free. Each trade setup comes with a profit projection as well as stock placement. Included in Market Insights is a Twitter alert service. This allows you to take advantage of intraday setups. Volatility is back in the markets. What does that mean to you? To me, it spells short-term opportunity each and every day. The days of trending up on lighter volume are gone. We have come off the highs with volume across the globe. Don't get caught in a complacency trap. Many of the indices have given back two months of trading in one week. We have a trader's market. You can take advantage of this trader's market by test driving my daily newsletter, Market Insights, free for two weeks. Market Insights will give you the edge you're looking for in the markets. Go to TFNN.com under Newsletter. Hit the Market Insight tab for your two-week free test drive right here, right now. Homeowners, did you know a burglar could break into your home and get away in just five minutes? A locked door may not be enough to keep a thief out of your home. Think about what you can lose, and then think about this. Now you can get a free security system monitored by ADT, the leader in home security. Pick up your phone now and get free hardware, free medical and fire alert, and free activation. It's an $850 value. Just call Protect Your Home, your authorized ADT dealer, at 1-800-949-8207. You'll get 24-hour protection, and there's no cost for parts or activation. So call now about a free security system monitored by ADT. Call 1-800-949-8207. $99 installation charge. 36-month monitoring agreement at $35.99 a month. Call for terms and conditions to this offer and protect your home license numbers. Call now. 1-800-949-8207. That's 1-800-949-8207. Would you like to discover the next great tech stock? David White, TFNN's technology guru, has just launched his new newsletter, The Technology Insider. In his newsletter, David will be looking for those shining stars that may turn into the next Apple, Microsoft, or Cisco. 
David combines his technology background as a software programmer with his market skills as a successful professional trader to give you this unique newsletter. We're on the verge of the next great tech run. With the Technology Insider, you'll be in front of the run-up and not lagging behind. David is developing a long-term investment portfolio. Therefore, we're only offering the Technology Insider as an annual subscription with a remarkable price of only $395. That's right. For a little over $1 a day, you'll receive the fundamental technology wisdom and technical trading skills of the Technology Insider, David White. What are you waiting for? Go to the front of TFNN.com, click on the link on the front page, sign up for your two-week free trial, and become a Technology Insider today. What type of investor are you? Conservative, moderate, or aggressive? No matter your investor personality, your overall portfolio should reflect your financial goals, time horizon, and your risk tolerance. Help ensure your portfolio is appropriately invested with an asset allocation plan from Morgan Stanley Smith Barney. Simply picking the right stocks is not enough. Research has shown that choosing the right proportion of stocks, bonds, and cash is essential to the success of your long-term investments. Morgan Stanley of Smith Barney believes a carefully selected portfolio can lower your volatility and increase investment return potential. Find out about what asset allocation and a Morgan Stanley Smith Barney financial advisor can do for you. Call Angelo O'Brien, financial advisor and certified financial planner of the Clearwater, Florida branch at 727-441-6108 today to discuss your personal financial needs. Asset allocation does not assure a profit or protect against loss in declining financial markets. Investments and services are offered through Morgan Stanley Smith Barney, LLC, member SIPC. This segment is brought to you by Think or Swim. For more information, just click the Think or Swim banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Mm, it's always better when we're together. Yeah, we'll look at them stars when we're together. Well, it's always better when we're together. Yeah, it's always better when we're together. It absolutely is, folks. Welcome back. 877-927-6648. We're off to the races. You got the Dow down 62, the S&P's down 6, NASDAQ down 18, Russell down 6, the uh, NDX 100 down 14. And uh, let's go take a look at the uh, small caps. On the small caps, now, what the small caps are doing, the small caps are going to give us probably the uh, first signal as to where we're going to go in the markets. Are we going to reject the lows from August 9th? And on the low, uh, you do, folks, what you want to do is you want to go to the IWM. The low on August 9th was 63.76. Now, we did substantial volume. We did 207 million shares. Uh, when we came down on Friday, we came down with 72 million shares. Uh, we couldn't even get into the volume that was created on the IWM on September 22nd. That had 159 million shares. Now, we came down with that 159. It absolutely was telling us that, you know, we were going to come back down there and revisit that because we were coming into that swing point. We never even got above that. Well, we did get above it. Just no, we never got above the August 19th swing point on the uh, last bounce up. The high of that swing was 69.62 where we got to on the 27th was 69.39, uh, yeah, 69.62 versus 69.39. Now, right now, you've got the small caps trading below the August 9th swing. So 63.76 is what that is. They're trading at 63.52. Uh, you know, what, what, if this closes below it, it means there's lower prices to come, but you know it will bounce back up from here. What you're really looking for, if you uh, if you're somebody that plays the uh, TNA, uh, the TZA and the TNA, they are the triple uh, ETFs from uh, Direction Shares, and you can learn all about that by simply going to the uh, homepage of TFNN and clicking on the banner there. And you want to really learn how to, you know, the ideal thing, folks, is to learn how to play the triples and understand mastering probability, understanding position size and the money management piece of it, because you can really put that to work uh, to your advantage. So if you're in the TNA, what you want to see is you want to see it get above the low of August 9th. You want to see it get above the 63.76 area, which is, you know, the actual tick that's trading at uh, right at this moment, because that would give you, because I imagine we're not going to have the volume today, uh, folks, and uh, what it would do is it would tell you that you're going to go up towards the top of the range. What's the top of the range? The top of the range here that we see in all of these indexes continues to get narrower, narrower and narrower. And the top of the range here is probably the low of the September 27th swing point. That low is 67.22. So you're talking 63.76 
to 67.22. But it's it's not a bad trade because you've got your back up against the wall. So your stop doesn't have to be that much below uh, the low of the August 9th time frame. And uh, I mean, that's on the small caps. If we go take a look at, let's just take a look at the volume real quickly here on the small caps. We'll flop over to the 10-minute uh, or the 5-minute chart. Just give me just a moment to go ahead and pull that up. We'll see what kind of volume we have in the uh, small caps. Uh, the first thing that's going to pop up here is going to be the 30-minute chart. So as long as the 30-minute chart is up. So we're at 937. We're seven minutes into it. And what the small caps are going against here on the 30-minute chart, just the September 22nd swing point. And if we take a look at the low of that, and I'll use my tool, this uh, line tool that I have. Uh, so the low on that, let me get rid of this other line here so you're not confused. And let me go ahead and put the line on the volume because you really want to go ahead and correlate both the swing points and volume. You know, and what's really cool about the marketplace that we're trading right now between the August time frame and now is that th there's never been a better time. I haven't seen a better time where understanding price and volume at swing points has been so important. You can make so much money. If you want to take a look at the real patterns that are communicating to us, it is the volume and price at swing points. And so right now, that swing point there, we'll come back from break and look at it. That low was 63.49. The volume on a 30-minute, 9.6 minute, 9.6 million. Uh, we're already at uh, 3.9 million. So this is going to give us a pretty good indication of what the market wants to do. 877-927-6648. We'll be right back. FNN is proud to bring you the cutting edge of newsletters. Ken Shreve's Ultimate Growth Stocks. Ken is a top-down investor who lets price and volume in the major stock indices tell him when to be in the markets and when to be out. By using his unique blend of fundamental and technical analysis, Ken will protect your hard-earned capital while realizing breakout gains. Go to TFNN.com today. Click Investments and Newsletters and get Ken Shreve's Ultimate Growth Stocks free for two weeks. Studies show that 10,000 hours is what it takes to achieve outstanding results, unless you use the power of leverage. The power of leverage, folks, is key to attaining outstanding success in your trading and investing. I'm Steve Rhodes, co-host of The Money Masters with Tom O'Brien, seen daily at TFNN.com, and author of Mastering Probability, a daily trading and investment newsletter. Let me take your trading to a new level, a whole new level. Let me teach you the secrets that the real money masters use each and every day to produce consistent financial results. On top of that, I'll transform your life in ways you never thought imaginable. You'll overcome hurdles like an Olympian. Here's the beauty. I'm so certain that I'll transform your life. I'm giving you a 30-day unconditional money-back guarantee. Time, folks. Something you'll never get back. The time is now to take action. Go to the homepage of TFNN.com and order Mastering Probability. It'll change your life forever. At Tiger Metal Exchange, we pay you more for converting your jewelry to cash. Let's go to uh, Brian in New Jersey. Hey, Brian, what's going on? Hey, Tom, I uh, just want to let you know I did uh, give you some jewelry. Uh, my jeweler offered me uh, about $650. I should get a check in the mail tomorrow for about 1200 At Tiger Metal Exchange, it's all about honesty when converting your jewelry to cash. Okay, let's go to Paul in Florida first. Hey, Paul, what's going on? Well, I want to commend you on the Tiger Metal Exchange. I just did a deal with you guys the other day. Oh, good. I'm very happy. <laughs> well, I appreciate it. Now, yeah. did you sell us jewelry or did you buy coins off us? Yeah, I sold you jewelry. Okay. Yeah. Awesome. What we weighed it at was less than you guys said, so, you know, you're totally honest. At Tiger Metal Exchange, we give you the tools to value your gold, and it's absolutely free. Call 866-618-8888 or log on to TigerMetalExchange.com. We've created the easiest, safest, and most honest cash for gold process. Tiger Metal Exchange. It's the only call you need to make. Here's what people are saying about Tiger TV. Let's go to John in Tampa. Hey, John, what's going on? Hi, Tom. How are you, sir? I'm doing great. You having a good day out there? A wonderful day. I, I love your uh, Tiger TV. I watch it every day. I'm a, like a kid in a candy store. Oh, man, I appreciate you out there watching it. How long have you been watching the Tiger TV? I watch it almost a month now, and it's just it's wonderful. It's pretty cool, isn't it? Oh, yes, it's cool. You see the charts and everything. Thanks so much for the hard work. Tiger TV, a great news service from TFNN. Dot com. This segment is brought to you by South American Silver Corporation. For more information, just click the South American Silver Corporation banner on the front page of TFNN.com. Mm, it's always better when we're together. 
Welcome back, folks. 877-927-6648. Little by little, I'm waking back up. It was a long weekend, if you will, and, uh, and a long weekend because there was just so much energy uh, in about a two-week period of time that I put into the uh, workshop that uh, we pull, pulled together. And uh, again, I can't thank you enough for all of you folks that attended, and I look forward to seeing the rest of you, you know, at our next workshop that we did. Uh, that we do now you know what i what i want to do is and, and you know perhaps the importance of this nine o'clock sh uh, show because i take it very seriously you know because of the information that's out there and i want to help you in being able to put together what's going on in the markets because you can put this together you know before the show starts if you go around the world take a look at what's going on because you know this is what you want to do you need to invest in yourself and you want to be able to invest in the tools the tools can be some of the charting packages uh, that you use you certainly want to uh, invest in the education to be able to educate yourself because you know that if if in the next three to five years there's going to be such a shift uh, with regard to what goes on in the world you don't want to leave yourself behind and there is no place on the planet that I know of where you can get this type of information there's nothing that even comes close to the type of information that you know, take a look at just today's lineup you know after this show you've got Tom and myself that do a show so we'll bring you you know currently what's going on in the markets there then then in the on deck circle you've got Basil Chapman you know and then in the hole if you will you've got Larry Pesavento and then to uh, the warm-up band for Tom at three to four to today is uh, David White. You know, you're talking about fantastic minds. These are all folks that I respect so much and have such great information and there's such great tools for you. You know, I just went ahead and went around the world, took a look at, you know, if you just simply listen to the folks on uh, the media, doesn't matter whether it's CNBC, any of the media outlets, or maybe the radio outlets, the real world with regard to what's really going on is looking here in the charts. You know, how much more would it have helped you to understand that, hey, you know what, the euro is really at a Gartley buy. The dollar index is really at a Gartley sell. Uh, you know, we have these other Gartley patterns on the futures contracts. How would that have helped you in your trading and what actions? Look, there's, there's no guarantees, but when you're able to put this together, you're able to say, you know, folks out there in the media, you really don't have a clue as to what's going on and what it is that they're communicating. That's not the case here at TFNM because we absolutely are giving you the real live information and also the roadmap, folks. The roadmap right now to success is being able to change just like this. So we don't come in here with an opinion. All we're doing is looking at the patterns. As I mentioned to you, there have been no better patterns than information being released to us at the swing points, whether it's intraday charts, whether it is the daily charts, the weekly charts, in this case here, the small caps. So we were talking, uh, taking a look at the small caps. I went ahead and punched the 30-minute chart uh, up on the screen. And you can see we talked about the two swing point areas when we were looking at the daily chart. The swing point from the 9th of September, or the 8th of September, uh, the 9th of August and the swing point from September 22nd and the uh, volume uh, for the August 9th time frame on the 30 minute I've got to make this a little bit smaller here so that this sticks out is all the way up here you can see we're not even close to that volume uh, you know we did test the uh, uh, we did we are testing in this 30 minutes here the swing point from September 22nd but you can see by the candle formation it's rejected it you expected it to reject it when you went around and you took a look at what was going on with the dollar index what was going on around the world and you really want to be able to put those trading tools you know in in your tool bag you absolutely do if we now go ahead and we go down because we're uh, let's see here 15 minutes into the uh, trading session I'm just gonna go ahead and pop up a five-minute chart let's just see you know what is the volume here showing us are we just closing the window the gap that it left from this morning you can see that in the second uh, five-minute session you had 3.3 million shares uh, come in uh, we've got volume is lightening up uh, just a bit as we have uh, closed this area you know the next area where on uh, the small caps will release some type of information to us on a five minute chart would be the swing point at 1510 so that's going to be 310 in the afternoon uh, from Friday you only did 1.16 million shares if the if the small caps move up to that area you know that's where it would release the information on a five minute chart if we cruise over and take a look at a 10 minute chart here real quickly the 10 minute chart says that the uh, swing point low and I wasn't paying attention to the number that I read off to you but on the 10 minute chart uh, it's a uh, 
1510, so that's uh, 310 in the afternoon. Uh, the low on that is 6495, 1.8 million shares. As you would come into that area, uh, folks, that's where it would release, release information. What type of information? If you come into that swing point with more than 1.8 million shares, it says you want higher prices. If you come in there, you tag it, and you're doing it on lighter volume, then you're just simply going to come on back down. You're going to do a breathing pattern. You're just going to do a uh, you're just going to do a retracement, if you will. So that's what's going on in the small caps right now. As we're talking, you've got the Dow down 31, the S&P's down 3, uh, the NASDAQ down 7.7. Uh, uh, let's just go take a look at some of the top 10 holdings uh, in the NASDAQ. So let's see what pops up on my screen here first. We've got all 10 of them. Let's take a look at uh, Google. Let's see what Google's doing here. And on uh, Google now, Google is trading down into the swing point of uh, August 19th. Now the high there is uh, 5.1487, the low is 4.9006, it did 5.4 million shares. I liked how Google traded coming down uh, on uh, Friday, it came down with only 2.7 million shares, got closed at, let's see, what did it close at, 5.1504, and the high of that swing point was 5.1487. So it you know it closed just above that uh, area, and right now it's trading down at 5.0672. So if we take a look, just let's look at the retracement that it's doing. Let's take a look at any A, B equals C, D pattern that might be out there on Google. And the retracement, uh, the point seven eight six retracement is 50534. So that's one of the first things that you want to look at. And now let's take a look at a ABC pattern. And the ABC pattern, let's see where that completes us at on Google. The ABC is 50188. It's just below that point seven eight six, if you will. It is uh, just below the uh, where it got down to the low today was 512. So you know, or 512. How's that for how's that for not being able to read a screen? That was the high. The low is 50384. If we take my uh, Gartley uh, pattern here, we'll see that what Google's done is Google's made a Gartley uh, buy pattern, if you will. And look at that, really kind of some nice numbers. You got a 786 retracement. You got a 1.272 expansion, folks. Anyways, uh, we're going to be going into our last break. When we do, we'll go to Mark in Bedford, Mass. And 877-927-6648. Thanks so much for being here, and we'll be right back. Mm, it's always better when we're together. Yeah, we'll look at them stars when we're together. Well, it's always better when we're some extra cash to help pay off some of your bills? Let Tiger Metal Exchange convert your unwanted jewelry to cash. We pay out 80% of the market price for gold. Our payouts are the highest in the industry, more than double our largest competitors. And we've created the safest, easiest, and most straightforward process for converting your jewelry to cash. Log on to TigerMetalExchange.com and get your free scale, your free eye loop, and get the cash you deserve now. We provide a free online calculator that converts your jewelry to cash at up-to-the-minute spot prices. We insure your items for up to $75,000 per shipment free of charge. We videotape the entire valuation process so that you can view it online. You can call us toll-free at 866-618-8888 or log on to TigerMetalExchange.com. Let Tiger Metal Exchange put more cash in your pocket without ever leaving the comfort of your home. Join the list of thousands of satisfied customers and go to TigerMetalExchange.com. It's the only click you need to make. Would you like to discover the next great tech stock? David White, TFNN's technology guru, has just launched his new newsletter, The Technology Insider. In his newsletter, David will be looking for those shining stars that may turn into the next Apple, Microsoft, or Cisco. David combines his technology background as a software programmer with his market skills as a successful professional trader to give you this unique newsletter. We're on the verge of the next great tech run. With the Technology Insider, you'll be in front of the run-up and not lagging behind. David is developing a long-term investment portfolio. Therefore, we're only offering the Technology Insider as an annual subscription with a remarkable price of only $395. That's right. For a little over $1 a day, you'll receive the fundamental technology wisdom and technical trading skills of the Technology Insider, David White. What are you waiting for? Go to the front of TFNN.com, click on the link on the front page, sign up for your two-week free trial, and become a Technology Insider today. 
Put the power of the Chapman Wave methodology to work for you. No matter what market you trade, what time frame you trade in, or your trading style, the opening call, Basil Chapman's daily market newsletter, is bursting with the information and trades you need to become a more successful trader. I've been using Basil Chapman's Chapman Wave methodology for several years now. His Chapman Wave can be used for any time period for not only equities, but futures, currencies, commodities. I've been also a subscriber of his opening call, which I find an invaluable tool. the potential of the market each day. He gives you opportunities to go short and long. It includes recommendations on stocks. I strongly recommend people using the Chapman Wave and I very, very strongly support the use of his opening call. To find out more about Basil Chapman and his Chapman Wave methodology and to get your two-week free trial of the opening call, a $64 value, visit TFNN.com today. Great Basin Gold is a mining company engaged in the exploration and development of two emerging gold properties in Nevada and South Africa with a total resource base of more than 23 million gold ounces. Great Basin Burnstone Mine in South Africa opened in February of this year with a resource of 20 million gold ounces, becoming the first mine to open in the historic Whitwaters Rand Basin in the last 30 years. The Burnstone Mine is projected to have a 25-year mine life and is fully financed with production anticipated to be over 250,000 ounces per year at a cash cost of only $450 per ounce. The Hollister Mine in Nevada became fully integrated in the fourth quarter of 2010 with annual production estimates of 110,000 ounces of gold per year over the eight-year mine life at a cash cost of only $527 per ounce. Great Basin Gold is cash flow positive and trades on the Toronto and New York Stock Exchanges under the symbol GBG. Hi, folks, this is Tom O'Brien. My new book, The Art of Time in the Trade, Your Ultimate Trading Mastery System, is for sale at Amazon.com for only $18.40. Mm, it's always better when we're together. Yeah, we'll look at them stars when we're together. Well, it's always better when we're together. Yeah, it's always better when we're together. Welcome back, folks. 877-927-6648. And again, thanks so much for joining us. Let's go to our caller. Let's go to Mark from Bedford. Mark, thanks for calling in. Hey, how you doing? Doing great. Yourself today? Very good. Uh, good. Uh, even after uh, last night's uh, Jets game? Uh, I don't know. You know, I really, uh, to be honest with you, I'm a... I'm a uh, <laughs> I don't really care. You don't? <laughs> <laughs> no, I am I really don't care because the way I look at life is uh, the better team wins every game, and I'm not a you know I'm not a Jets fan. Ah, sure. okay, okay, all right. For but some I, reason. I like I, I don't I don't know who I really like anymore. Uh, the, Detroit Lions, people, baby, right? the Detroit Lions, baby, the Detroit Lions, four and zero. They came back and the uh, biggest, I think the uh, biggest uh, comeback for the Lions since uh, 1954. Last time yeah, they like uh, last time like they went the all the way, and the biggest letdown for Dallas. Uh, uh, I don't know forever, but but certainly a big twenty-four point uh, swing there. So yeah, uh, beautiful, yeah, beautiful thing. You, you wanted to look at the uh, you wanted to look at the cues. What are you looking to uh, do there? Well, I, I went long this morning. Uh, the TQQQ. Okay. And, uh, and go ahead. I'm just in, in for a day trade here and uh, trying to figure out if I can uh, it, where where I should probably. Uh, try to shoot for okay so uh you know one of the things that, that we were doing just before uh we went to the last break is i just simply went into the top 10 holdings inside the queues just to see what was going on we took a look at google which you know i like the way that it closed uh, yesterday it has set up uh you know a uh, a gartley uh, buy pattern if we take a look at apple you know which really is the one that you've really got to pay attention to because it's about i think still around 14 15 percent of the queues uh yep. apple is setting up a tiger gartley now the Tiger Gartley, you know, is going to be completing somewhere in the area of 369 to 377. It's trading at 375.82, uh, you know, and it, it it has a pretty wide 
uh, true rains on a daily basis. And I say tiger garly, folks, because what you want to do is you want to take a look at the uh, swing point, the B point, which is September 26th on Apple. You did 29 million shares. Uh, we got below it, but we got below it first with 23 million shares, then 19 million shares. And, you know, now today it's got 4.6 million in the first uh, 30 minutes of trading, but we have to dig down a little bit further to see if all that came in uh, at the open. So on the queues, uh, you know, I do like the uh, I do like the trade based on all the other setups here. Um, but it's going to be important to you know on the queues to also key in on the small caps, uh, uh, Mark, and because you know that yeah, the, the, yeah so the the IWM yeah because that's that's the weak that's really the weak link out here that's the thing that is testing the August ninth low nothing else. Uh, is down uh, to those areas yet, and uh, and so if uh, you know you really want to be watching that because that's going to give us, in my opinion, that's going to give us the first signal here. You want to you want to see the small caps reject that area, with the Qs being the strongest. Uh, you know that it, it makes sense that you would go long uh, the Qs. So you don't want to see the you know, from my standpoint, I would pay, even though you're in the Qs trade, I would pay more attention to what's going on in the small caps. Okay, so I have one more trade that I put on this morning. I, if you have a second, you could. It, it's MGM. MGM. Okay, so I'm in at eight ninety five. I was in at last on Friday. I bought it at nine oh nine. Sold it at nine eighty six. Yeah. Okay. So on MGM here, and then again. Yeah, on MGM, you've got the swing point that you're going against from August twenty second. The low there is 901 you probably know that you just simply want to see it get back above that straight in at 898 uh, right now if i pull that back any further uh there's probably there's another swing point that's going against all the way back into the september first time frame but we've got to we've got to head out but go take a look at that september first swing point as well thanks so much right, for calling thanks. good to hear from you folks stay tuned tom and i are up next and uh, we'll be back in a moment it's